from the Environment Agency. Um, I work in the Environment Programme team and we're here today on the River Whitewater looking at wood habitats in the river and enhancing them using different sizes and bits of wood. So what we're looking at here is some habitat work that we did a few years ago which has caused the channel to pinch over the far side creating some spawning gravels for the fish of nice clean gravel and trapping and sorting the sediment. So we stood 20 metres downstream of a bit of wood and you can see that we've got this development of this marginal ephemeral habitat which gives us a big diversity of plants from some of the reeds on the top of the bank to the in-stream plants like water parsnip here which we've got. We've got water mint here. Lovely. That's good for potatoes. And what we find in these plants and around this coarse and large wood is a whole processing factory. So we've got a little bit of a wet leg. We've got um, invertebrates. We've got um, algae. We've got um, zooplankton and this stuff really is crawling with different species so if we take a closer look got gamerous can you see that mm -hmm. yes we've got fish food there we found the caddis fly larva and we've got lots of organisms that shred and process the organic matter which takes some of the nutrients out, it takes the suspended solids out, it reduces the cost of water treatment and it provides uh, a lot of benefit for the local wildlife, fish, kingfishers, moorhens, swallows, uh, they'll all be eating this at some part of their day and without it you have a very degraded system. Thank you very much Dan. Perfect.